again um, as we look at who wrote the gospel of Mark it could be said well did Peter write it and you could also ask um, was the apostle Peter's input within the gospel and I would say the, the truth is in the middle there uh, Peter didn't write the book of um, of um, of Mark because uh, there are a number of pieces of information that the Gospel of Mark leaves out of Peter embarrassing details and that's obvious why that is because if Mark is taking the material from Peter and he's writing it down he's not going to put things in that's going to embarrass the person who's giving him the information so it backs up that Mark is the author but he's using Peter and then it also backs up that Peter's input was in the gospel because obviously he wouldn't want things put in there that that embarrass him uh, so for example um, we see uh, things left out such as um, Peter not having faith as he should uh, in Mark chapter 6 verse 45 uh, if you look at Matthew chapter 14 verse 22 to 23 um, it, Matthew is a bit more clearer as to Peter's um, unbelief uh, and you can go right through and there's many many uh, quotations that you can actually um, look at you can also see Peter is obviously involved in the gospel because we get incidental uh, detail that comes out that shows that Peter has been involved in the input of the gospel such as uh, we see um, we get detail about uh, Peter's house uh, in Mark chapter 2 verse 1 to 5 etc so that specific detail that's about petite Peter's home um, so I would say that Matthew, uh, sorry, Mark wrote the Gospel of Mark, but it had the input of Peter. I think the evidence is very clear.